Hey, James Wise from Holton Wise. Today, I have a Section 8 occupied rental property for only $14,900. But more importantly than that, what I want to do, I want to explain to people like you the things that other turnkey investment companies won't tell you about investing in these types of properties. Let's dive in. <laughs> Ten eight one seven Olivet Court, Cleveland four four one zero eight. Price fourteen thousand nine hundred. This property has three beds and one bath, and it is currently occupied to a Section Eight or CMHA tenant, and they are paying eight hundred dollars a month. The annual taxes on this are only four hundred thirty five dollars a year. According to the seller, the roof, the furnace, and the hot water tank were all replaced about ten years ago. The electric panel has been upgraded to the breakers and in the actual city of Cleveland, in Cleveland proper, there are no point of sale requirements. You're probably thinking, whoa, $800 a month in rent and it's guaranteed by the government and the purchase price is only $14,900. This is literally the greatest real estate deal ever. What is the catch? This property, this investment deal, this will make someone a lot of money, but there are a lot of you out there who are watching this and I do not want you to buy it. This property would be horrible for certain investors out there. If you are a brand new real estate investor and you have never invested in real estate before, this property is not for you. If you are an out of state investor and you do not have a huge infrastructure, an actual team on the ground, and I'm not talking about a team like Holton Wise, a third party company. I'm talking about your own company. Like you employ people hourly to work for you. If you don't have that type of infrastructure set up, this property is also not for you. Why? Because the risk. This is a high risk, high reward investment property. Here's the thing about investing in neighborhoods like this. First, if you're not familiar with the quality of this neighborhood, I want you to go ahead and check out the Ultimate Guide to Grading Cleveland Neighborhoods. That is a comprehensive guide where I have graded all the rental neighborhoods in the entire Cleveland area on an A to F scale. This is gonna fall in that F class, okay? When you are investing in an area like this, you are investing in the roughest of the rough areas. When you watch our Tenants from Hell video series that we have here on the Holton Wise channel, are the types of properties that those crazy stories come from. When you buy a property like this, you're going to run into some serious risk, some serious problems. Vacancy, evictions, vandalism, drug use, violence, property damage, bed bugs. The worst of the worst, the worst things you've ever heard about real estate investing will happen at a property like this almost guaranteed. Now I put out another video where I show you exactly how to analyze and estimate your net return on a rental property investment. Now, when you buy a property like this, you're gonna run your numbers slightly different than in this video right here. So, to calculate numbers on a property like this, here's what I want you to do. First, I want you to calculate your rent, which is $800. Then, I want you to calculate the expenses you know about, your insurance, your taxes, your water bill. Then, what you need to do is you need to estimate your variable expenses, repairs, vacancy, non-pay, and on top of that, I want you to go ahead and add in your capital expense investments. After you add up all those numbers, you come up with your total expense number. From there, you divide that number by your gross rents. Then what I want you to do is take that last number and throw it away because it's completely irrelevant. You are trying to predict an unpredictable asset. That is the thing. With properties like this that are this risky, you cannot actually predict exactly what you're gonna make. Hence, the value, even though the rents are $800 a month, the value is not 50,000, 60,000. It's only 14,900 because nobody knows exactly how this property is gonna perform. It is literally 
impossible. There are too many variables at play. These blighted areas are not controllable. So you're making up for all of that downside with your upside, which is the fact that you can get in so cheaply. And if you have skills, knowledge, and experience, you can make money. But if you're the type of person who wants a turnkey company to walk you through and make it a very smooth and easy process where we hold your hand and then you just passively make a consistent return, that's great. That's what we do here at Holton Wise but you are not the right buyer for this property. Now, it's not that I don't want to sell this property. I just want to make sure I sell this property to the right buyer. Now, if you go on websites such as Bigger Pockets, where it's a social media platform for investors to network with each other, you'll see a lot of times these investors, they end up complaining about turnkey providers. I don't think there's ever really an issue with the product that these turnkey providers are selling to these investors. I just think they're selling the wrong investors this product. There's a lot of investors in this world who get rich buying this stuff. I myself am one of them. What I think is wrong and what I think is important for buyers to know is know what you're buying, okay? If I show you a Lamborghini and I show you a Kia, you should all know that the Lamborghini is gonna have a much different driving experience than the Kia. Where we run into issues is when someone takes an unsuspecting buyer, sells them a Kia with the idea, with that buyer thinking they were gonna get that Lamborghini experience. And that is what I wanna avoid doing and that's what we wanna avoid on this channel, okay? Here at Holton Wise, we're all about providing education and you need to know what you're getting. When you are looking to purchase out-of-state rental property, you wanna do so in a way that allows you to make money and avoids you from being one of these people in one of these types of threads, okay? So there's some very simple things that you can do when you're buying these assets. You know, I've actually commented on this. One of them, you don't wanna buy in the roughest neighborhood in the urban core. You want to pick solid B-class suburban investments. You know, maybe a 1950s or 1960s bungalow. Always, always hire a third-party property inspector. You need to see exactly what you're getting. Because again, there's nothing wrong with buying a high-risk $15,000 property. There are people that make money. The issue is when you think you're buying something different, when the script is flipped. You always, always want to get an appraisal. Okay, you want the bank to come in and tell you exactly what this property is worth. Because when you're buying a property with financing and you're getting an appraisal, the majority of the money, 75% of that money is coming from the bank. The bank ain't gonna let you lose their money, guys. So you always wanna get an appraisal. And to that, after you get an appraisal, never ever purchase the property for more than the appraised price. If you take a look at this one from this guy, Todd Fry. As you'll see, what really comes out to me is this guy comes over here and he pays over $8,000 over the appraised value of the house. Guys, you have to look at the fundamentals when you're investing in real estate. You never, ever want to pay over the appraised value of a property. It doesn't matter to me what the rent or returns are. You know, look at your pure fundamentals of residential real estate investing. The only thing that you should look at when evaluating the price of a residential property, and that's properties between one and four units, is comparable sales in the appraised price. I don't care what the projected cap rate or the projected net return is. When we are valuating residential real estate, comparable sales and the appraised value are the only thing that matter. These high risk properties, they're affluent. There's tons of them. There is burned out landlords and landlords looking to sell properties like this every single day. There has been for the last hundred years. There will be for the next hundred years. So never, ever, ever pay more than that appraised price. Another thing you want to do, make sure you're purchasing these with clear title. Don't buy anything on a quick claim deed. And then you also want to make sure your property manager is a licensed real estate brokerage. So when you're looking at out-of-state investment properties, make sure the person selling it to you and offering you the property management is a licensed brokerage. And lastly, what I want you to know when you buy these out-of-state investment properties is you cannot eliminate all the risk. You could only mitigate it. So if you are a risk-adverse person, if you don't like risk, Absolutely, this property's not for you. 
you want to go towards those safer, safer properties. B-class assets, perhaps like a nice, simple 1950s, 1960s bungalow. You don't want to go with that 100-year-old house in a high-risk neighborhood. So the buyer of this property is going to go in, understand all of those risks, purchase it, battle every single day. But if they're experienced and they know what they're doing, they will etch out a return. So if that is you and you have the knowledge, experience, and infrastructure to handle a high-risk property like this, send me an email, jameswise at holtonwise.com, or click the link above or below. Cleveland, Ohio is widely considered to be one of the top rental markets in the entire United States. This is because here in Cleveland, our housing prices are low and our rental prices and demand are high. At Holton Wise, we provide the complete turnkey solution for all real estate investors, whether they are local, out of state, or even abroad. As real estate brokers, we will provide you with agent representation to help you buy properties ranging from single family homes to large apartment complexes. We even have referrals for lenders who can provide investment property loans to investors located in all 50 states, allowing you to capitalize on the use of leverage or other people's money. We have referrals to top-notch title companies so you know that all of your transactions are safe and secure, with every single property being delivered to you with clear title. Once you close on the property, we have an investor-focused insurance brokerage who can handle all your property insurance needs. This insurance brokerage handles auto, home, life, and business policies, but they specialize in working with policies for landlords. We also have full service property management. We can handle all rental property advertisements, tenant placement, rent collection, evictions, maintenance, landscaping, construction, and repairs. In addition, Holton Wise also offers digital media and education. One day, when you are ready to sell your investment, Holton Wise, as the number one seller of investment properties in the greater Cleveland area, can market your property in a video just like this one to our worldwide base of investors who are looking to capitalize on the high cash flow opportunities in the Cleveland, Ohio market. Thanks for watching the video. I'm James Wise, co-founder of Holton Wise. If you are interested in hearing more about me and my personal story, how I turned one investment property into a management portfolio valued over $50 million, I want you to go ahead and follow my personal Instagram, at jameswisehwpg. I want you to go ahead and click the subscribe button for more real estate deals and educational content, as well as check out some of the other videos we have throughout this channel. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy.